In this tutorial, we'll be taking a look at how to open Spitfire plugins in Bitwig. This process will vary slightly depending on whether your library has a dedicated plugin or if it opens using Contactful or Contact Player. If you're uncertain which type of library yours is, you can check on the product page for the library on the Spitfire website or refer to our article linked in the description of this video. Regardless of the type of library you're looking for, you'll want to first ensure that you've downloaded the library via the Spitfire Audio app and followed the relevant instructions that were included with your purchase email. Further instructions on the download and installation process are available in other tutorials on our Clips channel or in articles in the Spitfire Audio Support Centre linked in this video description. If your Spitfire library has a dedicated plugin, you will find it in Bitwig's Devices browser. If the panel isn't displaying, you can click the folder icon towards the bottom right, or if you have your Devices panel open, simply click the plus symbol. With either option here, you can either search for your plugin by name or scroll through the list of available plugins. To narrow down the list, you can filter by locations and select your plugin type. Here I've selected VST3 plugins. Simply find your plugin from the list here and double click to open. If you're loading Contact Player, you will again head to the Devices browser to add a plugin. Find your version of Contact in the list or narrow the list by selecting Native Instruments under the Creator filter and then load your version of Contact by double clicking. You may load either Contact Player, which is the free version, or a full version of Contact if you've purchased this from Native Instruments as shown in this example. Once you open Contact, simply browse through the library section. Beneath the artwork of your chosen library, choose Instruments and then double click on any patch to load. If you're using Contact 7 and prefer to use the Rack View, you can find your plugin by browsing the list and selecting the bank on the right hand side. If you're opening a library that requires the full version of Contact, you will load this by browsing the Files tab within Contact. If you're using Contact 7, we recommend using the old browser view instead of rack view. Once you have loaded your full version of Contact into your software instrument track, click on the Files tab. You will then need to browse for where you have installed your library folder. Simply open the folder, open the Instruments folder, select your instrument patch and double click to load and you're all set to go. Thanks for watching Spitfire Clips. Let us know if it was too long, too short, too fast or too slow in the comments down below. Hit like if we answered your question and subscribe for more clips, tips, tricks and exclusive Spitfire content.